If we look at the history of customer and interaction with businesses, there's a slight apathy in Britain. And I think we've got worse over the years. And I think what happened, certainly in the retail industry, which I focus on, is that in the boom years, the growth of here and people spending and also with value so much value coming onto the market that we cut back actually on customer service and real experience for people and I think now you know after the big crash what we've got are people who are saying I'm really going to choose and what's developed is what I call the kind of super high street of where they can buy anywhere or connect with any brand at any time and I think businesses are now thinking God we've got to get back on this and really look at how we connect our businesses to people in the right way. Number one, stop calling them customers and think of them as people. The minute you decide that they're customers, it becomes transactional. They don't become people. They're not humans with human behaviour at the centre of it. Why and what do people want from you and why do they come to you? What is it that you are giving them that makes them feel special? So I'd be thinking that way. I'd also be thinking about the touch points. There's so many touch points now that people interact with when they come to your business. It is no longer either over a counter, face to face, it's online, it's mobile. All those touch points seep an energy from them that really reflects your brand and you need some synergy across that. And I think the third thing is kind of ease up on it being too detailed. Actually just think about what the most important things that you as a human want to interact with people is and it actually normally at the base of that is happy people and I'd be looking at employing happy people, people who want to be in your business and it starts from the people every single time.